Here's Chief Meteorologist Gannon Medwick with your first alert forecast. 510 Thursday morning. Good to see you. Let's help you hit the road this morning with your odds for travel hazards forecast. Focus in this half hour of Carolina in the morning. Going to make that NC 133 through Brunswick County, specifically the Brunswick County stretch from Southport to Sunny Point. Little sliver of BSL and Brunswick Town and Belleville. Easy goings. Probably the biggest thing that will slow you down is as you're warming up the car, make sure your windshield doesn't have uh, frost on it. You may have to uh, either do the uh, defroster or the old elbow grease method with temperatures getting quite chilly in the night as expected under clear skies and with slackening winds. The lights of the Christmas tree in Southport. Speaking of Southport, front and center on your West Shore home. First alert sky cam from Oliver's on the Cape Fear at Bay Street and House Street will head up river to the lights of downtown Wilmington as seen from the Murkison building. Yeah, clear skies. It's crystal 30 degrees at ILM Airport. Winds are calm. So zero, that's a small number, but that's huge because that means we don't have an extra wind chill on top of already cold conditions. I would say lower and middle 30s as a rule. Plenty of middle and upper 20s mixing in. We had another morning like this, uh, what, the tail end of November. Holiday air in a classic sense. As chilly as yesterday morning was, temperatures are a little chillier this morning. And they'll be chilly tomorrow morning, but I think this morning with that delta is going to go down as the chilliest one of this work and school week. So let's respect that with an extra layer. Doesn't have to be rain or snow repellent though because our radar scan is free and clear of echoes. And it'll be like that all day today. Sunny, crisp, cool, nice and simple headliners in your TTT today, tonight, tomorrow forecast. Yeah, a little slice of 30s tonight, but probably not as deep down. And that'll set us up as well as an emerging southwest breeze will set us up for a milder outcome for tomorrow afternoon. Let's take from today into tomorrow with your Cape Fear and Carolina cloud and future radar model. Crystal clear conditions get a little bit muddier, but future radar stays quiet. That's a 4 p.m. Friday pause point. Zooming out, a system to the west has my attention for not so much Saturday, but the Sunday portion of the weekend as low pressure charges through the Ohio Valley, a strong cold front will string through southeastern North Carolina. So showers look very likely. A few stray storms are possible, so you want to stay alert Sunday. And of course, if you have some traveling to do, do that with care. Background winds are going to be quite feisty, so think about deflating holiday decorations. And with uh, gale conditions quite possible, if not probable, offshore, Bill, that'll be a day to stay in port. Another spell of clear and chilly conditions likely follows the front. And that would be in the early next week portion of your seven-day forecast. Back to you.